Okay, okay. So for today's video, we're gonna talk about HFE. Okay, so I don't know if you guys uh, uh have done your HFE or not, or is going to do your HFE. I just want to do this again because a lot of people may be thinking of entering the market in two zero two four, and they have no idea what is HFE. I still get a lot of buyers contacting me to view houses, and when I ask for HFE, they ask me what is HFE. To me, is oh my goodness. Okay, if you don't know what is HFE, it's oh my goodness. So I want to do this video to help the public understand what is HFE and what are some of the issues that you will, you will get from HFE and also what are some of the things that is happening on the floor about HFE. Number one, before you allow to buy a HDB flat, you need to do a HFE. If your HFE is approved, okay, number one, you have to check whether your HFE comes with a HDB loan or not. If your HIV don't come with a HDB loan, means you have to use a bank loan. So you, no matter whether you need loan or don't need loan, you want to pay full cash, you also need a HFE. So please do not argue, just do a HFE. Number two, the biggest problem with HFE today is it takes up to two to three months. Some people even take four months to get their HFE approved. So if you haven't, haven't start doing your HFE, please do now. Because if you do now, now is January, Maybe only by uh, April or May, then you can start buying your house. Because HFE take about 3 months to 4 months to approve. Next, I have here a lot of cases already in the market. Lah, okay, But disclaimer, lah, disclaimer, here say only, lah, here say. HFE have disclaimer also. HFE is not 100%. Meaning that if your HFE write that you have this grant, that grant, this grant, that grant, but later on, when you buy the place, you submit, there may be changes because maybe the documents you give is incorrect or there will be some mistake. I don't know. Ah. I hear say only. Ah. So I my advice to everybody is HFE is not the, the last, it's not the final answer. I hear say ah, there's cases where people in the HFE was given uh, maybe 40k grant. In the end, the, the grant was only 30k. Then there are some people that are not given grant in the end, was given grant, you know. So um, I just want you all to understand there's cases like that. And HFE is not the final answer, okay. Only when after you buy, then you submit your document, that's when you get your final answer. So HFE is just a guide, just a guide. Ah. Next, HFE is very important. There is a lot of buyers today in the market. Okay, they just see, see, look, look. They just see for fun. They are not ready to buy. And this is also the reason why you all don't have HFE. So agents are very clever. Agents always ask for your HFE when you want to arrange viewing if you are representing yourself. So please get your HFE ready because if you never do your HFE, it means that you cannot buy. And if you were view without a HFE, there's no point the agent open for you to view because you cannot buy. So HFE is very important. The last thing is that the government has extended the HFE validity from 6 months to 9 months because they cannot cope with the amount of application that they have on their site already. So to me, this is not an issue or is this an issue? I don't know, but I feel that HFE is something new in the still considered very new in the market because a lot of people still unsure what is HFE. A lot of people still unsure uh, whether they should do or don't need to do. And I still have people telling me, hey, I'm going, I'm not taking loan, you know, why I need HFE and all these things. Okay, so HFE does not equal to your home loan eligibility, HLE. So HFE is just an approval that allows you to buy HDB flat. But this approval actually comes with a HDB loan if you are eligible for it. So that's it for today's video. Hope you like it. Hit the like button, subscribe button. I see you in the next episode and bye bye.